goes up, he gets elbowed in the head, and then he falls, slamming his head on the floor. So he was really hit twice. Hard to watch. Knocked out cold here. Tonight, though, good news, he is out of the hospital. A lot of people concerned Oof. last night. KFC is Brett Boganski showing you his road to recovery. There you go. Goodness. New Orleans Noel took two hits. Andrew Wiggins hit him in the face with his elbow in the paint, and then Noel came down hard on the floor. He was knocked unconscious. The Thunder Center had to be carried out on a stretcher with his head and neck stabilized. You can see a lot of relief right now and concern. Doctors evaluated New Orleans Noel here at OU Medical Center where they diagnosed him with a concussion. Fortunately, he doesn't have any broken bones, but he still has quite the road to recovery. We don't want to move them too soon because everything that the body does, whether that's thinking, whether that's moving, everything requires a lot of brain activity. Sports medicine doctor Megan Meyer diagnoses head injuries like the one Noel suffered Tuesday. She said every patient and concussion is different, which is why doctors, parents, and coaches need to see if their athlete is suffering from symptoms like headaches, loss of consciousness, personality changes, and even vomiting. This is something that even though we can't see it on imaging should be taken equally as seriously because it has problems down the road if it's not treated correctly. Brett Pagansky, KOCO 5 News.